In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a flashing light effect. I'd like to begin by changing my stage color to black. My next step is going to be to insert a new symbol, and this has to be a graphic symbol. I'm going to name it GR, which stands for graphic, and then light. And I'll hit OK. I'm going to draw a circle over my center point, and then I'm going to insert keyframes every 10 frames. up through 60 frames. I'm going to click back on each one and change the color. And if I test the movie by hitting Enter or Return, you'll see that they just instantly change from one to another because I did not put any tweening effects in the timeline. Because they are graphic symbols, I can use them as many times as I want in my stage or in my scene. So I will select several of these And then if I want to align them nicely, I can use my black arrow tool, select all instances of my graphic symbol, hit Command-K on the Mac, Control-K on the PC to bring up my alignment window. Um, let's see. Align horizontal center. That'll do. Okay, so what I want to do is have an effect of the lights blinking. I'm going to test this by hitting Command Enter, and it's not going to work. Because it is a graphic symbol, the graphic symbol timeline is tied to the main timeline. If I put in a keyframe and test it, I have blinking lights. If I go to frame 1, I have to select my keyframe here and select an instance and go to the properties. I can change the first frame. I want this one to start at 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50, which takes us through all of the colors that I put in, because we ended up with red again. Now, if I test it, it looks like the lights are chasing each other which if I make them much smaller can be used for Christmas tree lights. You can use this effect for blinking windows, sparkling stars. There's lots of different ways you can use this light effect.